Hello friends, welcome to another day on this autumn island, which is going to have kind of a creepy, cozy feel set at Halloween time. So I have a lot to do to get this island done before Halloween. Luckily, Timmy and Tommy have set up their shop, so that's one step closer to getting the three stars. There they are, and Mabel's here as well. My goals for today are to set up the first three plots and go villager hunting for our first three villagers. I also want to get the campsite down and get our first campsite villager all moved in. Bring in a couple other villagers, probably via amiibo for those. I think you need eight villagers in order to get KK Slider onto the island. So of course we'll need to get three stars and then bring on KK for his wonderful concert and hopefully unlock then waterscaping and terraforming. I have so much to do on this island. I'm excited, but also really, really nervous. So let's start the day out with a little visit to Tom Nook. In the island broadcast this morning, he was interrupted by a phone call. There he is again on the phone. Hello, Thomas. How are you? Don't mind me just standing here, eavesdropping on your conversation. Very sorry about that. But it looks like he's talking to some potential villagers that want to move on to the island, so that is perfect. I want to get our first three plots as soon as possible. Hi, Mr. Nook. What was your phone call all about? Sorry to keep you waiting. For some time now, we've been advertising the Creposi Getaway Package. That's wonderful. And we have three interested parties. That's great, Mr. Nook. I would love to help you get these houses prepared. Of course, you can count on me. I'm really excited to see who we bring on. I already have some ideas of what villagers I want to have on the island. Okay, but first we need to build a bridge so that we can have enough space on the island, enough places to put these plots. So, okay, let's build this bridge here and get this set up on the island. Okay, let's head over here to the river mouth and I think this is gonna be a good spot for now. Build right here, this looks great. I don't know if this is where this bridge is going to stay long-term, but for now it's good. Awesome, wonderful, love it. Let's skip ahead to the next day. Okay, we are at the next day. The bridge should all be in place. Let's go check it out. There it is. You can now walk across to the other side of the island. Perfect. Let's tell Mr. Nook the good news. Hello there, Thomas. How are you? The bridge is in place. Ah, Dana. Hello, hello. Thanks to you, Creposi has its very own bridge. Please take these three housing kits. I gladly will take those off your hands, Thomas. I'm so excited to go hunting for these first three villagers. So I'm just going to keep these plots in my pocket for now. I'm not going to set them down. I also have loaded up on a bunch of Nook Mile tickets that I have gathered from a treasure island. So I am all set to go hunting. The only villagers we're going to come across for this initial hunt are going to have either a normal, peppy, or lazy personality. I've put some thought into what villagers I want for this island. So since this island is going to be kind of creepy, kind of cozy, I want villagers that also kind of fit that vibe. So kind of cute, but also kind of creepy. I don't have anybody in mind for a peppy personality, so we're just going to take the first villager we see that fits that personality type. As far as a normal personality, I'm only looking for one. I'm looking for Dina, the little green duck. She has a haircut that kind of reminds me of Frankenstein's monster, and I think she would fit that role very nicely. She's cute, but also kind of creepy. I know there are other normal villagers that can fit the cute and creepy kind of vibes, such as Coco, Peaches, or Kiki, but I've already had all three of those on my horror movie themed island of Fog Hollow, and so for this island I want to have completely new villagers, ones I've never had before. As far as the lazy personality type goes, I'm looking for three. So I'm looking for either Biscuit, the cute little dog with the glowy eyes. He kind of reminds me of a phantom or some sort of ghostly creature. I'm also looking for Cole, the little black rabbit with the pointed teeth. He kind of reminds me of Count Dracula. And last but not least, I cannot believe I'm actually saying this, but I am also looking for Zucker for this island. He is literally walking, talking food. He has a skewer through his head. He has sauce smothered on him. He is takoyaki, an octopus Japanese snack, ready to be served up and eaten. And that just is creepy. And because he is walking, talking food, I think he would make a perfect zombie for this island. If there is any island that I'm going to have Zucker on, I feel like this is the one. And I'm very, very terrified. In my opinion, Zucker is the creepiest Animal Crossing villager, but let's see if he's on this island. We are searching for him. Who's here? Oh, who is that? Is that Benjamin? Hello, Benjamin. How are you? You're so cute. Look at those big, bushy eyebrows. All right, we're not looking for Benjamin. He's very cute. Not creepy, though. Next island. Who is here? Anybody? Oh, it's Lily! <gasps> Hello, Lily. There is nothing creepy about you at all. You are super, super adorable. So pretty. Look at her coloring. I love everything about her. I have had her on my Four Seasons Island before. She is not who we're looking for, but what a treat to find Lily. What a great find. All right, island number three. Who is here? Come on, somebody good. Maybe somebody we're looking for, but uh, who is this? <gasps> Savannah, hi. 
Another absolutely adorable villager. I really want to have Savannah on an island sometime. She's so pretty. Okay, next island. Oh, it's Elmer! Hello there, Elmer. You are on my half city core, half countryside island. You're adorable. I love you so much. All right, next island. Who's here? Come on, somebody we're looking for. <gasps> Is that Jeremiah? My favorite frog in this game. Look at his squiggly little mouth. I love him. He is on my husband's island, and he's so adorable. I'm sorry, Jeremiah. This is not the island for you, but I love you. Okay, come on. Who's here? Who's here? Bamboo Island. Somebody good? Oh, my goodness. It is Bo. I love Bo so much. He's in the top five favorite villagers for me. He's so adorable. I've had him on a few islands. I love him. Love him. All right, come on. Who's here on this island? What villager will we find? Who is it? It is... Savannah again? No, no, no duplicates on this hunt. All right, Wilbur, no duplicates. Who's here? Oh, hi, Freckles. Wait a minute, I think Freckles might be a peppy personality type. Let's see. Great to meet you, how are you? I'm Freckles, welcome to my hypetastic island getaway. She is definitely a peppy, so we're gonna take her and I think she fits this theme very nicely. We're not gonna keep her, but I know some people think that she might be a little creepy because her eyes are spaced apart. I think she's kind of cute, so she fits that vibe. A good temporary villager. She's not going to stay, but I think, come to my island for now. I think you will love it here. Look at her. Look at how cute she is. Do you think that Freckles is cute or creepy? Let me know in the comments down below which side you stand. So we have our first plot filled. I'm so excited. Now the only villagers we're going to see are going to be either a normal or a lazy personality type. So Wilbur, take me to the next island, please. Normal and lazy is all we're gonna see now. So who is this next villager going to be? Somebody we're gonna take home? Oh, I am so bad with the sheep names. Who are you? Hello, Vesta. She's kind of cute, kind of creepy. She has a little bit of that ghostly vibe, I feel, but not who we're looking for. Okay, my favorite islands, the climbing islands. Come on, Wilbur, who's here? Somebody good. Come on, who's here, who's here? It is, oh no, an anteater. No, who is this though? I don't know who this is. Annalisa, how are you? After my last island with Annabelle the anteater, I guess she wasn't really an anteater, but no, I'm done with anteaters. They cause drama. At least she did. Annabelle did. But I'm sorry, Annalisa. I'm gonna leave you behind. Have fun up here. Okay, next island. Who is here? Oh, it's Peaches! I had you on Fog Hollow. You would really fit this theme, but you're already a villager I've had, so I hope you have fun out here. Nice to see you again. Come on, come on. Who's here? Oh, it's Walker! He's so cute. I really regret not getting him for my Disney-themed island. He would have been perfect for that island, and I just didn't think of him at the time. He's so cute, though. Who is here? Who is here? Come on. Oh, it's Celia. I really think Celia is so pretty. Probably my favorite eagle in this game. Look at her. She's adorable. Someday, Celia. I will have you on an island someday. Just definitely not this one. Okay, come on. Next island. Who's here? Oh, it's a bird. Is that Sandy? Let's go say hello. Hello there, Sandy. How are you? I'm not looking for you, but nice to see you. Next island. Are we going to find a normal or a lazy? Oh, Celia again? What? Why are you here again? No, no, Wilbur. No, I said no duplicates. Okay, come on. Who's on this island? It's Rattle. Oh my goodness. He probably would be a really good fit for this island, like a mad scientist. But I'm kind of thinking I want to have Petrie on the island to represent that role. But Rattle is super cute. Very fitting. Cute, creepy. I like it. All right, one of those peek over islands. Who is here? It is Dora. We had you on my last island, my rainbow flower core island. You're so cute. You fit the white section of that island very nicely. Another climbing island. Who is here? Somebody good. Who's at the top? It is Walker again. Why are we having so many repeats? I mean, he's adorable. Adorable, but Wilbur, I have to have a word with you. Come on, who's here? No duplicates. No duplicates. Oh, no. It is a kangaroo. They can be cute and creepy. The babies are cute, but they move in unison with the mom, so that is creepy. Fitting for the island theme, but I just don't want to have a kangaroo on this island. Sorry, but have fun out here with your baby. Another climbing island. Somebody good is at the top. I just have a really good feeling. Somebody good is here. It is. Oh my goodness. It's Callie. She's so cute. I really love all the squirrel villagers. Look at that face. 
Adorable. Someday, Callie, I will have you on an island, for sure. You're so cute. Who is here? Come on, Wilbur. Somebody good. Where did you take me? It is another kangaroo. It's Carrie and baby Harry. Another cute yet creepy duo, but not for this island. Sorry. Let there be somebody good on this island. Who's it gonna be? It is another kangaroo. Three kangaroos on the last few islands. Wilbur. What is happening here? I know that they're cute. I know that they're creepy, but I don't want a kangaroo. Another peak over island. Not a kangaroo. No more kangaroos. Who's here? Where's the villager? Oh, it's a bird. Hello, Jacob. You're very cute. Very fitting to the fall colors, but not creepy in the least. You're very adorable. Another bird on this island. Hello, Gladys. How are you? Nice to see you. Who is here on this one? Come on, somebody good. It is... Ah! Oh, Jacob again? Wait a minute, Wilbur. I said no more duplicates. Why are you sending me to the same villagers? Wilbur loves to mess with me and I do not appreciate it. Who is on this island? Gladys? Again? Wilbur, no. This is duplicate day. It's definitely duplicate day. He is playing tricks on me and I don't like it. Wilbur, I have my eye on you. I am not happy with you today. Who's here? Rattle? Okay, no. It is not duplicate day. Wilbur, what is going on? Please stop playing tricks on me. Just find me my villagers. I need to get going on this island. All right, come on. Somebody good is at the top here. Who is it? Who is it? Somebody good that we're taking home. It is... Oh, hello there, Rodeo. We're not going to take you. I've had you on an island before, on my horror movie themed island, but you're very fitting for this theme. You're definitely creepy, but I also think you're kind of cool, kind of cute. Love you, Rodeo, and you'll always be Leatherface to me and perfect for my horror movie island. Okay, come on, Wilbur. Who's here? No duplicates. Somebody new. Somebody we're going to take home. Who is here? It is Celia again. Another duplicate. And Celia for what? The fourth, fifth time? Come on, Wilbur. Who's here? Not Celia. Not a duplicate. It is Marina. Hello, Marina. I am looking for an octopus, unfortunately. Do you know Zucker? If you do, tell him that I am looking for him and I cannot believe that I am. He creeps me out, but I'm looking for him. Who is on this island? I don't see any villager. Okay, we're gonna go this way. Who is here? Are they- Wait! Celia? Again! Again! Celia for the hundredth time. That is enough, Celia. I'm extinguishing your campfire. Come on, who's here? Somebody good? It is- Oh, it's Melba! I think Melba is adorable. Look at her ears. Look at her face. So, so cute. I really want to have her on an island someday. Not sure what theme yet, but she's so cute. Oh, it's Stu Maru. Look at you, Stu. I love you so much. Someday I'm going to have you on an island as well because you're adorable and you make me smile every time. Come on, Wilbur. We're seeing cute villagers, but I'm looking for creepy. Oh, that is definitely creepy. That is for sure creepy. It is Al. On a previous villager hunt, I saw him 10 times. He is my Animal Crossing stalker. No, Al, you're not coming to this island. Okay, no more Al. His butt cheeks alone are creepy enough. Who's here on this island? Somebody that we're taking, maybe. Oh, it's Skye. She's so beautiful. Wilbur, for once, I actually want you to take me to Zucker. You've creeped me out with him before, but come on. This time, is he on this island? I'm not sure if I really want to see him, but okay. It's Ellie. Hello, Ellie. How are you? You're super cute. Not Zucker, and that's a good thing. Lucky Bamboo Island, perhaps? Our villager is here, hopefully? Oh, no. Hello. Is this Bertha? Hello there, Bertha. Human hair on a hippo is not really my thing, but nice to see you. Oh, look who it is! It's Ioni! She's very cute. Maybe a little creepy because her tail, her galaxy tail, lights up, but I think super adorable. Alright, who's here? Oh, it's Cube. Those eyes definitely say creepy, but he's also super cute. Very fitting, but not who I'm looking for. Who is on this island? Come on, somebody we're taking. Oh, Bertha again, of course, because it's duplicate day. Who is here? Come on, come on. Somebody we're taking home. Somebody we're taking... Oh my goodness. Twice in a row. Twice in a row we see Bertha. Of course it's Jacob again. Another duplicate. Who's here? No more duplicates. No more duplicates. It is... Oh, it's not Jacob. It's Midge. They would be a cute couple though. Look at her. They actually would be really cute together. Hmm, something for the future maybe. Alright, who's on this island? Oh, it's Lucky! I love Lucky so much. He's also very fitting, but I did have him on Fog Hollow as well on my horror movie themed island. 
But look at him. So cute. Love him so much. Who's on this island? It is- Oh, who is this? Is this Marcel? Hello, Marcel. You're very cute. Also a little creepy. I might want to do a circus area on the island, and you could be fitting, although I think you're more of a mime than a clown, but I don't know, something to think about. Not yet, I'm, I'm not going to take you yet, but I will keep you in the back of my mind as a possibility. Who's it going to be on this island? Oh, it's Lucky again! I mean, he's a cutie. Very fitting, but no, I'm sorry, I've had you before. Come on, no more duplicates, Wilbur, no more duplicates. It is a chicken. Oh, it's Benedict. I think he's kind of cute. Hello there, Benedict. How are you? You're somebody new. All right. Who is on this island? Somebody good. Somebody good is here. Oh, it's Kiki. Super cute. I've had you also before on Fog Hollow, but very adorable. Very fitting. Come on, Wilbur. Somebody good. Oh, no. This anteater again. Nope. Come on. Who's at the top of this mountain? Somebody that we're taking home for sure. It is going to be somebody we're taking. Oh, Marina again. Look at the bow on the back of her head. Cute, but not who I'm looking for. Send me to another octopus. Back up here again, to the top of this mountain now. Who is here? Somebody good. It is, oh, it's Wade. I think Wade is adorable. It's somebody new, it's not a duplicate. Look at how cute he is. Super, super cute. Come on, come on, oh no, you again. Come on, Wilbur, who's here? Oh, it's Doc. I'm not looking for you. You're not really creepy, kinda cute. Who is here? Somebody that we're taking? Who is on this island? Oh, Celia. I am sick of seeing you. Come on, come on. It is going to be somebody good. It is- Oh, it's Punchy! It is a good villager, but not for this island. But very cute. How are you there, Punchy? Super adorable. Let there be somebody good that we're taking on this island? Oh, it's Silvana! She's adorable. I love her so much. She was on my spring fairy core island of Novali. Look at her. She's adorable. I love that little tail. Who is here on this island, Wilbur? No more duplicates. Somebody that we're going to take, please, on this island. Who is it? Oh my goodness. I'm done. I'm done. Wilbur, I am getting very angry with you right now. There better be a villager that we're taking home on this island. Please, let there be somebody that we're taking home. Who is it? Oh no. Oh no, there he is. There he is. The skewer is out. The stick is in his head. Oh my goodness. Oh, he's creepy. He's looking at- Oh, he's looking at me. He's looking at me. Am I really gonna do this? Am I really going to do this? Am I going to invite Zucker to my island? Oh my god, look at him. He's so creepy. That is sauce on his head. That is seasoning, not freckles, on his cheeks. And that is a skewer through his head. He should not be walking around. He should not be here. He should not be alive. He is walking, talking food, and he is the creepiest villager in Animal Crossing. He's definitely fitting for this island. Oh gosh, he's looking at me. He's coming this way. What do I do? What do I do? Do I really want to see him walking around my island every day? I mean, at least I have to finish this island within the month, so I'm not going to be with him for too long, which is a good thing, but do I really want to be with him at all on an island? Okay. I just think he's fitting for a zombie on this island. Oh, hello there, Zucker. Ew, he's so gross. Does anybody else share this thought with me? Do you think that Zucker is just the creepiest? Because I definitely do. But I guess I'm going to invite him to the island. Am I? Am I really going to do this? Okay, I think I just need to take a deep breath. I can do this. Okay. Hello there, Zucker. Oh, there it is. The skewer is there. It's so gross. It's impaling his head. That's just, oh, yuck. I may completely regret this decision, but Zucker, please come to my island. Ugh. Your island is creeposy, right? Yep, it's it's fitting for you, for sure. That sounds familiar. Oh, he's so creepy. He's so creepy. Some people might think he's cute if you don't know what he's supposed to be, but he is takoyaki. He is food. I like his catchphrase, though. Bloop is cute. But he's not. Oh, he's not. He's just... It's what he represents. If he didn't have the skewer in his head, maybe I could deal with it, but no. It's just... Ew, ew, he's actually gonna come to our island. What have I done? Okay, I need to find one more villager. We're only going to see the normal personality types now, so I'm looking for Dina. Hello there, Rhonda. You're not Dina. Is Dina here on this island? Who is this? Celia? Ugh. Maybe I should just take Celia. She's becoming creepy. Come on, come on, who is here? Be Dina. Oh, hello there, Daisy. You're very cute. I was looking for you for my Rainbow Island, but I got Goldie instead. You're super adorable. No way, it's Molly! 
I love Molly. Who doesn't love Molly? She's so adorable. I've had her on several islands before. Super cutie. Definitely not a good fit for this island, but would be very fitting for just an autumn themed island. I love her so much. Come on, Bamboo Island. This is going to be the lucky one for sure. It is not the lucky one. This is the lucky island. It's going to be, oh, it's Fauna. I love Fauna. She was on my autumn island of Mush Falls and she's so cute. Very autumn-like, super adorable. Is Dina here on this island? Maybe, hopefully. Is she? It is. No, it's Sky. All right, who is on this island? Come on, please be Dina. Who's here? It is Sky again, twice in a row. Wilbur, I really think you're just taking me to the same islands over and over again. This is it. Dina, please be on this island. It is getting, oh, it's Poppy. We're getting some adorable little villagers. Look at her. Very autumn themed also, super cute. I've had her on a few islands. She also was on Mush Falls, my other autumn island. Adorable, I love her. This is the one, oh my goodness. It's Molly again. I mean, I'm not angry about seeing her twice, but she's very cute. But come on, Wilbur. No more duplicates, please. The sun is setting and I need to climb this mountain. Please do not let this be, oh my goodness. Celia, again. Wilbur, come on, no more Celia. Who's on this island? I just wanna find Dina, who's here? It is, who's here? Nobody's here. This island is empty, that's fine. Oh my gosh, this island should be empty. Celia, go home. I time traveled back a few hours, so we had more daylight. Come on, Wilbur, please just send me to Dina. No, it's a new villager though, I'll take that, but not who I'm looking for. Bamboo Island, this has gotta be the lucky one. Who is here on this island? Oh my gosh, Molly again, Molly, please. I need to stop seeing your adorable face. You're cute, but I just need to stop seeing duplicates. Who is here? It is, oh, it's Coco. Another very fitting villager for this island, but I've had you already on my horror movie themed island. I cannot take the same villager on another island. I've had you, I want new villagers. Where is Dina? She's got to be here. Oh, it's another creepy kangaroo. Next, who is on this island? Come on, oh my goodness, Molly. I'm sick of this. Wilbur, you're just sending me to the same islands. Wilbur, I'm about to pilot the plane myself. Who's here? Fauna, what is happening? Wilbur, I need a different pilot right away. Send me a new one if she is not on this island. Oh my gosh, there she is. It's Dina. Oh my goodness. Dina, how are you? Does she not look like Frankenstein's monster? Look at her haircut, her green coloring. I think she's so fitting. She's very cute, but also that Frankenstein monster vibe gives her a little bit of creepy. All right, Dina, we're gonna invite you to this island. I've been looking forever for you. You're going to be a perfect fit. I'm so excited to have found you. Move to my island. I think I'll bring in Petrie also on the island. You guys can be neighbors. She could be the mad scientist. You can be her monster. It's perfect. I love it. We have found our villagers for our first three plots. I'm so excited. Let's get back to the island and get them all moved in. Okay, I'm gonna have to set up all three of the plots and make all the items. So let's put plot number one right over here. This looks good. Excellent, plot number one is down. Plot number two, we'll put right next to plot number one. So here looks like a good spot. Love it, great, wonderful. And plot number three, next to all the others, right here. This looks good to me. Perfect, all three plots are in place. Now let's see what items they need and we will craft those and get everything set up. So let's see, plot number one, what do we need here? Check interior items. All right, and check exterior items. Okay, perfect. Lots of things to craft, so let's get started. All right, Mr. Nook, I am here to craft a bunch of items for all these plots, so let's get crafting. Okay, placing items down, hay bed right here, perfect. Let's also put the swinging bench right over here. Love it, great, wonderful. Okay, move that up here just a smidge and turn it. Love it, great. Barrel can go here. And we should have everything we need for that first plot. Let's just double check. Check interior items, everything is accounted for. And we have all interior and exterior items, perfect. All right, let's place these items here for plot number three. Log garden lounge right here. Love it. 
and we will also add in the log stool. There, that should be everything. Okay, Mr. Nook, heading back to you. All right, Mr. Nook, I think we have everything in place. Let's get them all moved in. Everything is finished. Now to hurry with the rest of the construction and welcome residents to their home. Let me give you a token of my appreciation as promised. Oh my gosh, I thought he was gonna come up and kiss me. I thought that was his token of appreciation was I'm gonna come up and give you a big smooch on the face. Okay, it's fencing. That scared me. Just the angle here, it really looked like he was gonna come in to kiss me. I had a little mini heart attack, but you know what, it's fine. Okay, fencing, let's just put this in place. Let's pop this over here, just around resident services. This is not obviously gonna stay, but I just wanna put down all 50 pieces. Let's add a bit more over here and just finish it off. A few more pieces and that looks good. Wonderful, okay, fencing is all in. All the plots have been sold. Everything is ready, so let's time travel forward and get each of these villagers moved into their spots. Let's save and end, and skip ahead to the next day. It is a new day. There is Mr. Nook. Mabel is still here. But today's news, Preposy gained a new neighbor today. Oh no, Zucker's the first one on the island. Let's go, I guess, go see him maybe? Do I really want to do this? Let's check the map. Oh, it's for real. He's really here. There he is. Ew, okay. Okay, I could do this. Let's go say hello. He's in there. Yuck. Okay. He's fitting for the island. He's fitting for the island. I don't have to talk to him. I don't have to look at him each day. I can just have him exist. Oh, there he is. There he is. He's the zombie of the island. Hello there, Zucker. How are you doing? Look at him. Look at his face. Look at that sauce. Look at that seasoning. Look at that skewer. I want to play with everybody, but first, Bloop, I gotta get unpacked. Instead of unpacking, can we pack you back into one of these boxes and maybe ship you back where you came from? I'm starting to regret this. No, it's fine. It's fine. He's perfect for Creeposy. I just have to remember that. Back over here. Hello, Mabel. How are you? I need to set up your tailor shop. There's something I want to ask you. Could I bend your ear for a bit? Of course. Thank you. You see, I wanted to ask you about a location. I would love to find a perfect location for you. I know that your shop would be wonderful on this island, and I think I have a great spot. So she's going to give me the Taylor Construction Kit. I will take that. Thank you so much. Set it up wherever it makes sense to you. Great. I'm just going to set you up over here for now because I'm not sure where it's going to be. Oh, look at Harvey's here. How are you there, Harvey? How's it going? Finding a spot for the tailors, I think right here next to Nooks for now, would be great. So build right here. I think this is the spot. Perfect. I'm sure it'll move around somewhere else, but for now, it's great. Okay, I'm gonna time travel ahead another day and move in our next plot villager and see who it's gonna be. Oh no, there he is on the starter screen. A nice, good top view of his head. Just what I wanna see. It's another day. Who has moved in now? Is it Dina or is it Freckles? Hello there, Mr. Nook. Any announcements for today? Creeposy has gained a new neighbor. It's Freckles. All right, let's go visit her. Here's her house. Very cute. Oh, goodness. There he is. There he is. He's just wandering around. Oh, he wants to say something to me. What do you want? Good morning, Dana. Thanks for coming over to say hi. You kind of called me over. It's real cool that I made a new friend the same day I moved. I'm not your friend. I'm really not. So, um, what? What do you want? I'm afraid. What do you want to say to me? I got a welcome to the island thing, but for you, even though you already live here, what are you giving me? I don't really want a present from you. What is it? A doghouse. Thank you. Making this is kind of your secret skill. Oh, he made it. How nice. I can't wait to have lots of nap times around here. Maybe the whole island can nap all at once together. That's creepy, Zucker. Everything about you is creepy. It'd be like the nighttime, but at some other weirder time. Any time is weird for this idea, huh? Yeah, it kind of is. The whole island taking a nap together, a little strange. Okay, I'm walking away from you now. Let's go say hello to Freckles. Hi there, Freckles. How are you doing today? Welcome to the island. I took your advice. I bailed on everything and everyone I knew. Oh my goodness. I moved here. I live here now. I'm so excited to have you on this island, Freckles. I know your time here is going to be short-lived, but I hope you enjoy it while you're here. She's very cute. Okay, so now let's move Dina in, build the campsite, and get our first campsite villager. And then I'll also amiibo in a couple other villagers so we can get KK onto the island. Another new day, nice and sunny. There's Mr. Nook yet again. 
Creeposy has gained a new neighbor today. Dina, how exciting. Our first three plots are all filled. So I'm excited to go visit her. Let's go say hello. Oh, look at Goose over here pumping some iron. Hello there, Goose. How's it going? Hey, uh, Bouquet. You good? Bouquet. Bouquet? How do you say that? Bouquet? Whatever. Here he is in his cool sunglasses. Just lifting some weights. I don't know. I don't like your catchphrase. Okay, let's go say hello to Dina. Here's her house. And hello, Dina. Look at her just sweeping the floor. How are you? I'm so glad we met on the island and I'm all moved in here now. I'm so glad you're here too. You're definitely going to stay. I still have lots of unpacking to do. Let me help you. I will be happy to help you and get you all settled in. She's so cute. So I'm excited. Our first three plots are filled. Let's go talk to Mr. Nook again and see if we can get that campsite in place. We are going to need eight villagers to bring in KK. So right now we have five. Only Zucker and Dina will be staying permanently on the island. But we're close. We're getting close. All right, let's head over to the resident services building. Oh, look, here's Freckles, and she has something to say. Good morning, Ducky. See, she has a nice, cute, simple catchphrase. I have to get my brand out there, you know, let people know a future pop star walks among them. Of course, I understand. Oh, she's got a present for me. What is this? A Mr. Flamingo. Oh, Mr. Flamingo sounds perfect for a Halloween-themed island. I'm sure I'll find a place for it. Thank you so much, Freckles. I really appreciate it. Where should I put Mr. Flamingo? Let me open him up here. And we'll just pop him down over here for now. I do need to have a lot of items laying around the island in order for us to get a three-star rating. So let me put down this wooden wardrobe as well that I crafted earlier. Oh yeah, and I forgot that I still have Blather's tent to put down somewhere. So I want to keep him in his tent form. I think I'll put him up here somewhere. I have to be careful because if I want to keep him in his tent form, I cannot move him once he's placed down. I'm not going to upgrade, so let's just put him up here on this second story. This, I guess, is a good spot. I'll figure out something to build around here. Blathers, there you go. That looks good. Okay, I hope I don't regret this decision to put him here, but I'm hoping this is a good spot. Okay, so once again, I'm going to time travel ahead, get Blathers moved in, and then hopefully we can get the campsite. Yet another new day. A lot of time traveling in this video, I apologize. As of this very day, a brilliant fellow by the name of Blathers has joined Creeposy. Awesome, he's here. I probably won't be visiting him much because I'm not going to donate anything to him. I don't want him to upgrade from the tent to the museum, so... Blathers, enjoy your time up there. I gave you a nice spot, hopefully. Also, Resident Services will relocate from its current tent into a new permanent building. Yay! That means Isabel will be coming. I'm so excited. So let's go check on Blathers. I feel bad since I won't be visiting him much anymore after today. Hello there, Blathers. How are you? I hope you're having fun up here, enjoying your little spot that I picked out for you. A pleasure to meet you. My name is Blathers. So nice to see you. Truth be told, I'm determined to open a museum. Well, this might be the best you get. I'm sorry. I feel so bad. I mean, I'm not going to upgrade him. Let me know in the comments down below. Do you tend to keep Blathers in his tent or do you upgrade to the full museum? Because I usually always keep him in a tent. And I feel so bad, but I'm sorry. I just like you in the tent. Okay, so let's save and end yet again. Move forward another day. Oh, Resident Services is under construction, but Leaf is here. Resident Services is closed today due to construction. Okay, so it should be up and ready by tomorrow. I mean, we're trying to get this island done, but that's okay. Let's go say hello to Leaf. Hi there, Leaf. How are you? He's so cute. I wish they had more sloth characters in this game. Look at Pajmina just running around with the zoomie. She's so cute. She's just having so much fun. Oh no, here comes Zucker into frame. And Freckles! Hi there, Freckles! Everybody is here in the middle of the plaza. What is happening? Anyway, I'm sorry, I'm talking to Leaf. You guys are distracting me. Look at Freckles! She's running around, Pajmina's running around. They're just having so much fun. They're so cute. Okay, so I'm gonna go over this way. Oh no. What does Zucker have to say to me now? Look at that skewer! I need to buy him a hat. I think if I buy him a hat and he wears that around, maybe I can tolerate him a bit more. He's going to teach me the joy reaction. I mean, I need that reaction, so I appreciate that. But you're the one giving me joy? I find that a little ironic. Okay, Mabel, how are you? Do you have any hats in stock? Look at Goose over here, checking out that suit back there. What is he doing? Goose, you must really want that suit. Should I buy it for you? Mabel, I'm sorry. I know there's a potential for a sale here, but could you just give me a little bit of space? Okay, so I did not find any really big hats to cover the skewer, but I did buy Goose his suit, although I couldn't actually give it to him because I can't gift items to my villagers quite yet, but he will get it eventually. So I moved forward another day and resident services is all built up. 
As stated, today we've completed construction of the Resident Services building. Yay, it's here, we're progressing. That's not all the big news for today. We've also added someone to our island staff. Isabel is coming, I'm so excited. There she is, look at her, her beautiful face. I love her so much. I love that when she tilts her head, it sounds like a bell. So cute, and her head is shaped like a bell bag. So how adorable is that? I'm so excited she's here. We're getting closer and closer to getting those three stars. Oh, Zucker. There he is. I need to get you a hat. I really do. All right, let's go inside. Welcome to the new and improved resident services tent. Did I say tent? Of course I meant building. When you have a moment, please sit at my counter. I will gladly do that, Mr. Nook. Hello there. You wanted to see me? I want to do something grand to celebrate. I am all ears. Oh, got your attention. Our goal is to have the incredibly popular musician K.K. Slider come and put on a show here on Creeposy. First, we need more visitors to come to our island. Next, we need more folks to move here. And finally, we work hard to increase the overall image of this island. So for the first step, we'll increase the number of tourists by adding a campsite to our island. Yay! All right, I have the recipe for the campsite. I gotta go gather up some supplies. Oh, Pashmina, changing right here in the plaza. What is going on over here? Going over and exercising with Goose, I see. Are they friends? Is there a relationship budding? What is happening over here? What is Zucker doing and why am I cornered? I cannot move. I'm stuck here. I'm stuck here. Oh, get away from me, Zucker. Get away. Oh, yikes. Okay, okay. Where can I go? I've boxed myself in. Keep walking, Zucker. Keep walking. Okay, I have to gather up supplies, but this is very cute. Goose and Pashmina. I like this. Adorable, adorable. Maybe something is developing. Who knows? Okay, but I need to gather up supplies for this campsite, so let me just chop down some of these trees here, get some of this wood. That should be all the supplies I need. Why am I running with an axe? I look like an axe murderer on this island. This is scary. I am fitting in with the Creeposy theme. Okay, let's go into the resident services, and we're gonna craft out this campsite. Just crafting everything, and we have our finished campsite. Awesome! I'm just gonna put it here on the beach. So I think right over here next to these houses is perfect. Right here's a good spot. I think this is it. This is the spot. There it is. So I'm gonna time travel ahead two days to make sure that we have somebody in the campsite. Look at Isabel. Today we have a visitor staying in the campsite. That's exactly what I wanted to hear. Let's go see who our first campsite villager is. We have to take them. They're going to be a smug personality type. I wonder who it's going to be. There is one smug villager I'm really hoping for. I want Roswell for this island. I've never had him. So if he's in here, that would be super lucky. But let's go inside and see who it is. We have to take them, whoever it is. Oh, it's Pietro! He is so perfect for this island. He is so cute, but also clowns are a little creepy, especially at Halloween time. But I'm not gonna keep him on the island forever because I've had him on Fog Hollow. But he's so fitting, he's so cute. He's a perfect first campsite villager, I love him. I'm not sure if I'm gonna do a circus area on this island or not. I had a creepy circus on my island of Fog Hollow, and that's where he was on that island. It was perfect. But this island, I'm not sure if I'm gonna have a circus or not, but he's so adorable. Pietro, I'm so happy to have you as our first campsite visitor. You should live here with us for a while. I know it's gonna be temporary, but you're so perfect. You're so fitting for this theme. So I'm gonna have to make sure to get you a plot and put it down so you have a place to stay. Leave it all to me. I'll get that for you, and we'll get you all moved in. All right, I have the housing kit. Let's just put it right here next to the tent. You're not moving far here, Pietro. This is the spot. Awesome, and it is sold to Pietro. I am so excited. So I've time traveled ahead again so that Pietro is in his house. And oh, wait a minute. Pashmina, what are you doing over here? Whose house is this? Goose's house. Maybe there is a relationship brewing here. She's waiting for him, maybe for a date or something. All right, I also picked up another plot. I'm gonna put it right here next to Pietro's house. And we're gonna get another villager for this island. We need eight villagers total. So there's that plot down. And we will get somebody else. I'm excited. All right, so Pietro's moved in. I'm gonna go to a treasure island and just gather up somebody else. Pashmina, I hope he comes soon. I hope he didn't stand you up. So I've flown to a treasure island and I'm here to pick up Roswell. Look at him, he's so cute. Such an adorable little alien gator. I love him. I think I might have like a farm area for him with the spaceship. I think that might be cute. So here the plot is sold now to Roswell. I also picked up yet another plot. We need one more villager, I think, to hopefully get to three stars. So let's put this plot down right here. Wonderful. And back to a treasure island to gather up the next villager. 
So I am back on a treasure island and I am here to pick up Lobo. He's so cute. I actually don't think he's creepy at all, but I thought he might make a good werewolf. So that's why I'm going to get him. So that should be our eight villagers. Let's head back to the island and talk to Isabel and see if we are at a three star rating. Okay, Isabel, please give me some good news. Right now, Creeposy has a three star rating. Yay, we've done it. KK Slider is coming to the island. Mission accomplished, we have a three star island, KK has performed, and we can now unlock waterscaping and terraforming. I am so ready to start developing out this island, I hope I can finish it on time for Halloween. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, consider subscribing to the channel if you're not already. Thank you so much for following me on this journey to get this island done in less than a month. I hope you are all having an amazing day, and I will see you in the next video. Bye!